Welcome back to Let's Clean Power Wash Simulator. I'm Burning Dog Face, and this episode, like every other one, is brought to you by Dr. Power Wash's Power Wash Services. Apparently we're not the only name in town. We are the only one willing to work on the House of Death. Let's see. Finish off these steps here. Get the stairs themselves first. Why is there still so much? F oh, yes, duh. No, that's bricks. It's not even... No, that's not it either. So where's the... Oh, the whole deck is part of the stairs. That would explain that. And that does make me feel slightly better. You know, I was under the impression that grime, like the word dirt, just mostly means miscellaneous crud. You know, as opposed to the word soil, which only refers to this variety of dirt. But, uh... See that window over there, the way it blinks as I look up and down? See, that's a great example of the realistic reflections I was talking about as it's peeking through the trees. Except that it shouldn't be reflecting at all because the sun is behind that house. So I guess something really bright is going on inside that building. that most of them don't touch the floor. That's weird. Why does it even have columns if they're not touching anything? I was really having trouble scraping for a moment there. I thought I was hearing a strange noise for a moment there. I mean, I can still hear it, I'm just pretty sure it's part of the loop for the water sound now. Oh 
my. Yeah, all these surfaces. This is going to be a bitch. All that wood, too. Maybe I can get wood cleaner. Maybe I can make that work. I don't fucking know. Make it a stronger one? Yes, actually. Urban X... Urban X U2. Medium duty pressure watcher specializing in stubborn gr dirt removal such as graffiti! Huh. Alright, let's do that. Yeah. But how do I... Oh, no, but how do I... Oh, right, yes, you can... No, no... Right? No, it's back. That's right. Cool. And I do believe... I mean, I wouldn't go for it right now, but, uh... Not clothing, the other one. Uh... Modifications! Oh, a nice green one! Nice. What's the name of the one I currently have? Space Cadet, yes. That kind of goes with retro, but uh, I'll just go with the green one then. But for now... Oh, hell yes. This is a good choice. I don't even remember how much one, this one costs. How embarrassing. Oh, it's all, this is exagger- this is, uh... Exaggerating? What? No, this is exasperating, is what I was trying to say. Money is no object. My kingdom for more power! In fact... I just blew a hole through the building. It's alright. You know what smaller the nozzle looks in this thing? What? What was that about? I saw a little thing start to come up at the bottom. Oh well. Was each one of these posts a different thing? I bet it is. Yup! That's kind of funny. I didn't even touch any of the ceiling there on purpose, I think. Hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is again. Once again, all one big thing for railing. As opposed to post. Well, all right, well, with this, maybe I can do this. No, it's not a footprint. I must have just dabbed that with water at some point. Oh, yes, the actual meaning of the word dab. Huh. As opposed to that thing Zoomers used to do. Poor stuff being cool. As I sat in the sofa just now, I heard a strange sigh-like sound. Spooky. <laughs> you see, it's funny, because it's just the sofa settling. You know, it just occurred to me that I had assumed that uh, I was dealing with a lesbian couple here, but I don't even know that Aura is a woman's name. I mean, assumed, but... Although, for all I know, maybe it's just a pair of roommates who share an appreciation for haunted houses. Shouldn't go uh, making assumptions about people. That never leads to good things. I suppose I'm just romantic at heart, want everyone to be in a relationship. 
I like that you get paid per item. Oh, that wall is going to be a big... Oh, that's part of this wall, isn't it? Yep. Okay. Well, I suppose I should clean that off so I can get a nicer effect when I'm up there later. would be really, really loud in real life. Blasting a hollow metal object with high-pressured water? Fuck. Yes, this is very good. I am very glad that I, uh... followed in the footsteps of Captain Kirk and decided that I needed more power. Mind you, he only usually says that when he's got a concerned Scotsman in his ear telling him that he can't give him more power, but you know... Strangely relaxing. Oh no. What are these lumps? I've noticed them in all of the other houses around here. There... and there... I also noticed that you can't go nearly as far outside of the property, which is to say not at all, sideways as you can, uh... I guess they're both sideways, but whatever. <laughs> Suddenly realized. It's not like I'm going up and down, my dude. He said to himself, Sorry, just having that above the garage door was itching at me. That's a shadow. I feel embarrassed. I don't even need to get the whole wall right now. I just need to have this. Well, almost, though. Oh! Uh, that is a fascia, apparently. Huh. Doesn't mean anything to me. Oh! Oh, wait! What in the world am I doing? But it would be fun to uh, be on that side. Oh, 
Well, no, there's a whole fucking world of problems up there. I'm trying to focus generally on the area, but if I keep wandering off to other dirt in the in the vicinity. It's not the greatest game in the world to play for someone with ADD, let me tell you, but working on it. Look at this. Who did this? Why is everything so covered in mold? Again with a goddamn mold. By the way, in case the intro was too deadpan for you, this is, of course, a fictional business, so this is not, in fact, a sponsored video. The real trick for these guys would be to get special levels based on things where things routinely get messy. We can make it God of War, and it's the outside of Kratos' house, and the whole yard is splattered with blood in addition to the house being gross. mouse over it, and it's a Draugr blood. Tedious it might be, but very rewarding to finally get there. Apparently. Huh. And I can't uncrouch in that spot. That's not helpful. Man, that is satisfying. That bit right there when the camera's not moving. And it's not the easiest to control thing in the world. Oh. 
Oh no, the timer. Let's see, oh no, because I'm not done here yet. Well, I'll tell you what, I have earned a hundred bucks or so, so I'll reward myself for that achievement earlier. With this. And then I hit back. And I hit... No, that's not right. Oh, there was a way to do that. I have done this. Uh... Shit, I thought that was bad. Hmm. All right. I have, uh, well, I didn't remember, I found it. And it's, uh, even stupider than I remembered, to be perfectly frank. Gotta click on this part, right here. Nice. Now try and get this and, uh, wrap it up. stuff behind it, it's hard for me to tell. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, well, that would do it. Nice! Oh, it's just darker there. Sure. Okay. Okay, things do actually look a lot better here. There's nowhere for me to stand. Oh, you know what? Okay. Oh. Maybe that's the issue right there. I'm trying to get myself on this railing here. Ah, well. I'm Burning Dog Face, and improvements have been made. I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Clean Power Wash Simulator, when we uh, get back to scrubbing this place, and uh, then the only thing wrong with it will be that it's haunted! Yay! Hopefully, before that, we'll be getting back to Let's Play No More Heroes, and finding out what I do with all that money I'm going to grind out. Till then... Have yourselves a great day, Burning Dog fans. Later!